uh, a nuclear EMP is first strike doctrine for World War III. Uh, because if you can win the entire war on day one without firing a single bullet, if you could take out your country's ability to make war from their homeland, you don't have to fight the war at that point. So that's important to understand. Iran considers this Sharia compliant uh, in the sense that they don't actually kill a single person in their view. They detonate this weapon uh, above the atmosphere, 300 kilometers, and it goes off and nobody dies right then. Uh, they, in their war doctrine, say that our own arrogance and our dependence on electricity and the loss of our life skills is what kills us, right? So these are important things to understand that this is not some sci-fi thing. This is not some... And, and I know you don't believe that like some like this is never going to happen. This is there's lots of discussion on the world stage on the EMP threats. There have been multiple warnings. North Korea has come straight out and threatened EMP attack. Uh, a few years back, uh, Iran, we were talking about delivery systems. Iran tested a the the detonation of a an, an EMP weapon in the Caspian Sea off of a cargo ship with a K-Club missile launcher. Uh, so part of this is like, why aren't the American people finding out? It's because the media don't know information and they misreport. So when they did this testing, they used a Russian K-Club missile launcher. Hey, y'all, I need y'all to subscribe and smash that like button.